Hi guys, welcome back to more Hearts of Iron 4, another episode on the 1944 Survive Challenge series where I am playing through all the minor Axis nations on the 1944 Downfall mod and seeing how long I can last. So if you haven't checked out the previous attempts, please do, I'll leave a link to the playlist up here. Hit the subscribe button if you want to see more of this and let's have a look at what the leaderboard looks like. So spoilers ahead obviously from the previous episodes, but here we have, so the new leader in Hungary. So getting to the 19th of March 47, beating Romania by just two days. But without further ado, let's jump into the next one, which is Finland. So we will go with the disable Soviet offenses like always, like I said. Let's have a little look then. I haven't actually played as Finland yet, so let's just start with getting some expanding mining to get those resources yet. I know this is the whole new DLC. What well, we in the Axis anyway? Okay, just double checking that one. Um, a whole new DLC, and I haven't even played Finland yet. So that is a really weird template. So let's get rid of that anti-tank, and we'll put anti-air. And then what are these? These must be new for Finland. Winter Logistics Company and Long Range Patrol Company. Wow, I haven't seen these before. Um, yeah, let's go Long Range Company then. Improve our movement over a lot and then we'll knock that down to 20 width infantry to start. Let's go ahead and get the usual industry to begin with. And then, duh, 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 what do I want next? Let's go get the guns, I think. Yeah, we've got a nice bonus for that as well. We'll take them. Uh, what well, we got? 12 sieves. Let's just go and get some mills. I'm not doing forts this time. 10 factories, though. That is pretty poor. So let's go making some anti air because we're going to need some of that. And we'll make some anti tank steel. Uh, probably going to need some trains. Wow, I'm literally going to have like one factory on everything. This is going to be awful. Absolutely awful. Okay. Uh, on second forts, I'm going to get rid of the anti air. I haven't got any, so what's the point in making it? I don't think they're going to have air supremacy over Finland. Right, we'll go get uh, army defence. No, I won't bother with them. All weather. Oh, wow, we've got some good leaders. Let's have that genius uh, artillery. We'll go infantry expert. And then genius regrouping. Um, no, I think army logistics is probably going to be better for me. Right, for some reason, I've just gained another 15 factories. Was that because... No, that's just industrial and nothing to do with that advisor. No idea where these have come from. It might have just started wrong and it needed me to kick forward a bit. But I've just gained some factories, so at least we've got some industry now. Got these prepare moti tactics as well. Basically helping defend in certain areas. Okay. Interesting. Let's go and get the war support up quickly. Let's go digging hole to start with. Improve our stability as well, and then we'll take a few of these bonuses as well. Right. Let's tick on a bit. Let's see what's going on then. So Leningrad, I want to take hopefully pretty soon. That'll be a big boost for us. Although I am missing a lot of equipment. Bloody hell. Okay. Not a lot I can do to start with then, is there? Um, no idea what they've got as well. I don't have that information. Let's go get some steel off of Sweden, luckily. That would be very handy. Thank you, Sweden. All our troops are sort of getting... We've got a nice river line here in the south. Right, just look at the focuses. If I can get this Greater Finland and get the cores, I should be able to take those areas. So let's go and get Militarised Society to begin with. That will help out a lot. Yeah, none of these are cores yet. So if I get cores of like Mamansk, I'm pretty sure I should be able to push. No, I cannot push at all. <laughs> optimistic there, weren't I? Very optimistic. Um, the Dancing Ban. What on earth? I mean, yeah, we'll have 1% stability. Thank you for that. We will not ban dancing. Let's change to the better guns now. Starting to get a bit of infantry equipment back. Get the designer on that as well. 100 days or so, by the looks of it, we should be good to go and fully stocked up. Right, so we are now ready for Greater Finland 
when we control those two provinces but let's go and get some steel and bits and some sieves from a mine that I'm not even going to try and pronounce where it is somehow they've pushed me across the river but I'll push you straight back I'll take that Soviet and I'll raise you one pushback thank you right they're pushing a little bit in the north but not too bothered I don't think they're going to take anything are they they're not going to have any supply D-Day is kicking off. Unfortunately, I cannot help you out today, Germany, on this one. You're on your own with the D-Day. They've not even landed where I normally put my troops anyway, so that would have really shafted me in the back. Yeah, never mind. Germany, you better be able to deal with that. Right, I've run out of manpower. I can't go up a conscription law. I have stopped mobilising as well. Um, let's go down to war economy because then I can get that 3% back. Right, they've sort of pushed me a couple of tiles, but I reckon I can push them out of there because they've got no supply. And then we might get a little nice pocket of three troops. Yeah, they melted away. Can we get the, yeah, nice little encirclement. We'll take that to start with. Every Soviet defeated is one they've got to replace. Let's see if we can cut through here as well. They've got no supply whatsoever. See if we can cut them in half and then should be able to take the north quite easily. He says confidently. Can we push through? Yeah, we should be able to push. We found a mine, so let's go and get power from the dams. Right, push through here, and we've cut them in half, so let's push up again. They have literally got not many troops here. The ones they do have got no supply, so we'll encircle those. More for Finland to take. Ooh, Mamansk is. Oh, no, they've got troops on it. Damn. Okay, but we've pushed enough. No supply up here. They can't do anything. Can I push and sort of take this tile maybe and get a one little encirclement if you push down? Uh, no. No, I cannot. Right, stop that immediately. We will push in the north for now then. They are pinning us in, but we'll just go round and pocket them in and then they should pull out or at least we'll surround them. Right, these two armour divisions are pushing. As soon as they stop, I'm going to counter-attack and, and hold the ones in Leningrad. Hopefully I can... Yes. Oh, you fools, we got you with the counter. Leningrad is now surrounded on three sides. Right, they've sort of pushed and unencircled themselves, but they've abandoned everything else, so we'll just grab this free real estate. Thank you very much. Yeah, he's encircled, but I think I can unencircle myself again. Yeah, they have keep pulling back. We'll just take this, the uh, provinces that you're not in. We'll run circle around you. And we'll push them out. So we've controlled the north now. We've shortened our front considerably. Couple of little uh, last stands down in Leningrad while they push. Somehow they've pushed over the river again. But you have no supply. So we'll be taking that straight back. Request German support. What does that do? Oh, 25,000 manpower and 10% war support. Yeah, thank you. Oh, and a large shipment of equipment. Thank you very much. We will take that. And then what I'm looking for, can I do it? Yes, the reorganize the railway system because I'm going to build a supply hub here. Uh, let's go here and hope it's not taken. And my plan is then once we've got supply is to cut through the middle. So I'm going to need a little, little railway up to it. And then how long is that going to take? 16 December, just a month and a bit. And then hopefully I can cut this whole pocket off and encircle them. That's the plan anyway. Totally forgot I've got a air force. Didn't even check that. So we've got a few fighters and a few casts. So let's get them over Leningrad. And use that to hold the area we have. And hopefully take Leningrad soon. Oh look. You've pushed across the river again. I wonder what's going to happen here. Oh that's right. We're just going to put you straight back. Thank you very much. Right, the Germans aren't doing particularly well for November 44, but we can't help you there. Form a military government. I didn't even check these. I really need to play Finland, don't I? Maybe I'll do the, whatever that really difficult achievement is next. Yeah, I think I will do that. So we will form and we'll get, because I get some more, yeah, recruitable pop 1%. We need as much recruitable pop as we can get. And we get some through the system as well. Cool. Right, our equipment's looking alright. We are just lacking a little bit of artillery, but 
that's not the end of the world. We'll make some quickly. Right, our supply hub is made, so let me just go get a few more railways to improve the rest of our supply. There's a nice free province there we'll step straight into, and then they've, they've attacked in the north of it, so let's attack back with a counter and see if we can get a little encirclement of these two troops here. Yeah, nicely done, nicely done. More Soviets for the chopping block. And then we'll use that to push out. No supply here. We've got three against two with no supply. So we'll take that and then quickly... Oh, and they melted away. I saw a little helmet pop there. Push these through. We'll just grab as much land as we can. Move quickly. I wish... Oh, I should have made some cavalry. Never mind. I think I can... Yes, we've got the encirclement off. Oh, I do love it when a plan comes together. We've got this nice pocket of... They haven't got port, have they? No. Nice pocket of Soviets here. We'll grab some extra land and make this a bit thicker so they don't break back through. There's also a supply up here, so if I can take that quickly and then just join that with a little railway and then we'll have another supply hub in behind as well. The pocket is well and truly sealed. Let's just start pushing from the north then. Yeah, we'll take that. We'll grab and push down. They should be having no supply. I've got enough of it to get to the Greater Finland, so we'll grab a load of new cores. We do need that for the manpower, so that's good when that'll be done. We've got loads of equipment now, so let's go to the standard 21 width and we'll add some artillery in for some real punching power again. Yeah, very nice, thank you. And I will add the Winter Logistics Company as well for extra movement and attack in snow. I assume all of our country is in the snow. 20, 34 defence as well. Yeah, we'll have that. Thank you. Just close off this pocket now. I have no idea how many Soviets are here. Oh, we've got some numbers. What's that? 14 or 15 it looked like. Oh, goodbye. Thank you for joining us. But your presence is no longer required. And there we go. Oh, I wasn't paying attention down here. They've sort of pushed through slash my front line has moved. But we've got some extra men now. So that should be easy. I think we get a big bonus on core, don't we? So we're just pushing these. So he's either that or their supply must be terrible as well. But not a problem pushing that out. Right, Leningrad is holding. Greater Finland is done. So that should mean... Is this all cored now? Uh, why have I got resistance though? That's Surely it's cored. Yeah, it is cored. Core of state of mind. Yes, perfect. We are the Greater Finland and nice 113,000 manpower straight away. And what are we lacking? 118,000. Perfect. <laughs> that almost fit perfectly. Right, force attacking. Leningrad is ours now. We've got some more manpower. We are taking Leningrad. Yes! The fall of Leningrad, the formal capital of the Russian Empire, has been occupied by Finnish forces. A population over 3 million. Thank you. We will be using that population against you. Very nice. I think our lines are pretty secure now. We are looking rather good. Good industry and uh, equipment going on. So let's go and get some light tanks out. And we'll see if we can get a few tank divisions out. So we could do some encircling and cutting off. That would do, I think. The BT-42s. Never heard of it. I assume that's a real tank. Right, this here is a... rest of this is a core. So let's... I'm hoping they've got no supply. Yeah, they've got none. Let's push forward and grain the rest of this core states of ours. There should be a little bit of population in it. Oh, yeah, they're melting away as well. We'll just push right through you. See if we can cut them off a bit. See if we can do a little pincer. Yeah, three divisions there. One of them being an armoured one. Very nice. See you later, alligator. Let's push down as well. One little... Is that Romanians? Oh yeah, the Romanians have flipped, haven't they? Have we get them encircled? Yes, goodbye Romanian. Ooh, a naval invasion. The first one, and we got till August 45, so that wasn't bad. Let's take half of this unit defending Leningrad. I don't think we'll need them because we've got a river line. Let's give them a quick general. And let's march them over here to close these pockets. Right, they're, luckily they're not all they are. They're pushing into the port. I don't want them to take the port. Ah, uh, they took the port. Take it back. My tank unit is there. Come on. Yes, taking the port back. Oh, you're done for now. 
never ju never land on our shores soviets we'll just push in and take the rest of this thank you goodbye six divisions of the soviets lovely some helmet pops right just having a little look there's a few cores i've got pushing into the soviets so that's not one that's not that is so if we can push out of leningrad there's sort of three states here that we can take and they are cores and we will get that manpower First up, another little naval invasion. I've just moved all the bloody troops back, so half of you again, thank you. We'll take a general again. We'll have you this time. Go close this pocket. Yeah, haven't taken a port, no chance. Crush these ones. Uh, Germany is not looking in a good space. I bet we're not. No, we're not even a major. I'm going to lose here, aren't I? I'm doing so well, and I'm just going to fold. Right, my only choice is I've got to push out quickly and hopefully capture enough factories and land that I'll become a major and keep going. Oh yes, I've got across the line with some force attack. They haven't got anything here on the uh, west coast, so let's quickly spread out, push out as fast as we can. Yeah, nice, speed that up. Yes, they can't, they've got nothing it seems to sort of stop us. A few troops, but we'll just pin them and move around them. No, don't you dare. No! Oh, that's so unfair. I was doing so well. I was so enjoying this run as well. That's unbelievable. Right, 1st of November we got to then. Damn, I'm really disappointed with that one. I was really enjoying that one. I must be honest, I've got to play Finland again. Just as a normal run, I think. I'm going to think I'm going to enjoy that. But yeah, there we go. Let's have a quick look at the table. So that puts Finland in the bottom, but I was probably in the strongest position out of all of them. So, well, maybe Italy, but obviously that froze. But there we go, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for more and peace out.